Sergeant Keen I here reporting for duty and last we left off in Stardew Valley we had a chicken go missing and I now know why. The chicken went missing because there was a howl that happened the night before. It's a random event that can happen and when that happens some of your uh, animals disappear. Regardless of whether your barn door is closed or not, your coop door. So we we don't have that chicken anymore. The chicken got ripped real by some wolves. Oh, rip chicken, rip Lula. We're gonna have to buy a new chicken today, though, because uh, we definitely uh, need chickens to be part of our our community. That's sad, though. That's real sad. Though I don't think that they should be able to die if they're in your coop. Because how's the wolf gonna get into your coop if you? I mean, I'm sure it wouldn't be that difficult for them. I mean, I'm sure like you know, since I can easily open and close it, probably they can get in. But still, man, it sucks. Ruperino Lula, man. Cause I mean, uh, now we have to raise a new baby chicken. Oh, we have to work on the relationship with them again. Oh man, none of that. Sounds like something I want. I got her up to two hearts. That means like, you know, much better chance at better quality ingredients. And now I got to work on that all over again. At very least, though, we do have some cranberries that have grown. And that's pretty nice. So we'll, we'll definitely get a nice chunk of money today when we sell those. I just wish we didn't lose our chicken. I, I had a feeling we definitely did lose them. Cause I was just like, they're nowhere here, you know, like there's no chicken and now it all adds up cause you know, that was that wolf sound that was really weird that I wasn't paying attention to too much. And now the chicken is gone. It all adds up guys. It all adds up. Obviously a chicken is ripped. Ah, uh, at least, you know, these cranberries right here will easily pay for new chickens. All right. It's unfortunate we didn't have a coop upgrade that we could have, you know, made a new chicken before we lost our chicken. But, sometimes that's just how the cookie crumbles, alright? Give me all of the corns, alright? Let's make this fast. Alright, we got all the corn? Looks like we got all the corn. Alright, let's finish watering. Ah! I'm so happy. Now I think whatever, is it going to be probably every three days or so that a, a cranberry is ready? So that's going to be nice. That means some nice money coming in. Mmm! So excited for that though. And then we can finally get the freaking upgrade. Our chicken's probably still going to be growing as Coop is upgrading. And then, but when it's by the time it's finished, we might have a fully grown chicken. And then, oh, that'd be nice, you know. That'd be nice to have a fully grown chicken. Oh, I just wish we still had Lula. Rip, we need to be able to make crafted games, uh, freaking gravestones in the game. Uh, concerned Nate, that's what needs to happen. Gravestones for our ripped animals, literally. Not figurative at all. They've been ripped up by, you know, a wolf. I'm a little surprised that that was actually a thing, though. To be 100% honest, I thought, you know... Because I, I mean, they can't die from, like, not being fed. And, and animals, as of right now, can't get sick either like they could in some Harvest Moon games. So I'm actually surprised they're able to, you know, quote-unquote die at all. Obviously, you don't see anything and they just disappear. But, uh, you know... Unfortunate. Uh, definitely unfortunate. Alright, we're almost done watering though. And then we're gonna go to Marty's Ranch, buy ourselves a new chicken. Make sure we put a bunch of days worth of food in it. I'm not letting it outside at all. That thing can stay inside all freaking day. I don't care. Alright. No more chickens are allowed outside. At least as of right now. Okay, let's close this. But, I actually am serious. I don't want to, uh have to come in here and like be you know feeding the chicken every day so there chicken will always be fed at least for the next four days go to marnie's ranch before we go to marnie's ranch let's uh let's sell i didn't get any oh okay i was about to say i didn't get any gold freaking uh cranberries that's gonna be a little upset all right let's drop a gold cranberry in there and then uh let me drop two more of these and then we'll sell the rest because we're gonna bring those cranberries to the freaking festival too all right, drop that off, that, boom, corn, corn, corn. Oh, we're so rich. 
We're just we're just living in money right now. Like when this day goes by, we will have enough to do the upgrade. And I'll be grabbing out all my wood and stone because I don't know what I need. It's probably wood, but you know, just in case, I'll bring the stone too. And then we'll do that upgrade. Yeah. Upgrades coming. Alright, Marnie. I've had an unfortunate accident. First, I need to collect the blueberries, though. You can't just say not to collect the blueberries. I mean, look at all these blue... No, do not eat the... No, stop trying to eat the blueberries. Yes, give me... Oh, my God. There's so many... Oh, stop. Why is there have to be so many blueberries? I can't stop collecting them. Every time I see more, I'm just going to grab them. Like, I can't just leave them here. Okay, are we good? I think we're good. That, I want to get in... I want to chop that down so bad because i know that's where the secret forest is all right there's a secret forest we can harvest hardwood and like a couple other things there's like slimes in there sometimes too and i really want to do it oh my god come on stop why why game quit giving me these berries i i will i'm not gonna be able to get a new chicken today if, we, if they keep doing this to me i can't stop it's like an addiction oh my i'm just gonna you know what these berries aren't going to go anywhere. We do need to buy the chicken first before we run out of time. So I don't know when Marnie's shop actually closes. And I hope we don't miss it. Because if we did, that'd be pretty bad. Alright, we have time. She's here. Alright. Uh, purchase animals. Chicken, 800 gold. Oh, that's so expensive. Alright. Uh, boom, put her in there. Reppy. Crumbo, crumbo, combo. I like that. Combo, let's go. Little crumbo's on his way, man. Ah, uh, little combo. I promise you will not die. Watch another wolf event like happen tonight and he gets ripped on the first day. Oh, that would be so sad. That'd be incredibly sad. I'd hope that would never happen. Cuz I'd be very very sad. We've had we've already lost one chicken. We don't need to lose more. I mean, I'm sure it's going to happen at some point again. I mean, the wolf event is going to definitely not be like a one-time thing. But hey, at least we're going to get a bunch of money from foraging again. Can't lie about that. We got so many freaking things. We actually have... I think if I would have went around and collected every single blackberry all in one day, we probably would have had over 100. I'm pretty sure we would have. Because this is, like, pretty ridiculous. We already have, like, 60 at this point once we get this one. And we had, like, 40 or so the day before. So, or not the day before, like, two days before. But, dang, it's a lot. At least we can say we're going to make a lot of money today. And we do got to remember that not this episode, but next episode, I'm pretty sure it's going to run into Abigail's birthday. And we have to make sure we give her a present so we can get, um... Nice hearts. Gotta get those hearts. Probably should... I don't know if it's gonna count as a gift or not on her birthday. I would assume so. So I don't want to give up my gift. Like, you know, do something else and give it up. Because that would be bad. And then we can't give her a present on her actual birthday. Uh, we got anything else? Yeah, sell the common mushroom. Alright, let's go see a new baby chick. And start working on gaining a relationship with them. Because... We gotta start over. All right, open up. What's going on? How you doing? Combo seems curious, but a little cautious. She's getting used to her new home now. All right, it's a female. I'm pretty sure like all of them are female, to be 100% honest. I mean, apparently we have like a rooster that's just, you know, around and makes sounds in the morning to wake us up. But other than that, you know, it doesn't really do anything. All right, let's see if it's gonna rain tomorrow. I hope it is. Please rain. Uh, it's gonna be cloudy with wind. Dang it. Why can't you be cloudy with thunderstorms, you know? Even though that kind of destroys my crops. Farming level 8. Got more proficiency. Um, new crafting recipe keg. New oil re recipe oil maker. And deluxe reed grow. Alright. Holy crap. That made us 10,000. How much were these eat worth individually? Like 7, 100. Whoa, that's... These things are worth a lot of money. I could see why uh, people would like to make cranberries because that was a lot of money. We can almost upgrade our house too. That's a, we can actually. 
we have enough money to upgrade our house and do the coop. Of course, we can't do both of them at the same time, but that's pretty crazy. That's a lot, actually. Like, I'm, 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 I didn't realize... I knew cranberries are worth a lot. I mean, a lot of the berries in general are worth uh, quite a bit of money, but for it to just be that amount... Wow, like, you know? Can we just have those every season? Like, every season, can we grow cranberries? Because that'd be amazing. Because those are worth, like, you know, freaking... Yeah, I could, I could live off just growing cranberries all day. I would totally be down with that. Because then we would never have any money problem. Which, we don't really have money problems, I guess. I mean... Once we upgrade everything, then, like, money is, like, just a thing at this point. To, like, buy new seeds and... After a certain point, I'm sure it doesn't really matter. Uh, well, th that is unless you're, you, you're like a Java freaking corporate dude and you replace the community center with a the warehouse, then you're just evil because everything is upgraded with money, I'm pretty sure. Oh, man. Well, that's something, man. I can't wait to get this freaking watering done. I can't wait until we have an automated watering system. You know, I wake up every day, it's watered. That's gonna be freaking fantastic. As much as, you know... It, yeah, sure, we're not gonna... It's not as real as going out there watering it every day. I don't wanna do that. <laughs> this is extremely time-consuming. If we could, like, cut this out of our chore, like, permanently... Oh, we'd be set forever. I mean, really. That's like five more hours to our day as of right now. As though they still haven't grown another stage? Ah, oh, they look- they need to grow another stage. I will not drop how, like, weird they look. I will never grow freaking fairy flowers again because they just look so weird as they're growing. Never again. They don't look pretty when they're growing- hopefully they look decent once they're fully grown, but as of right now, like, they look like freaking fugly as butt. And I don't like that at all. Uh, let's go down from here. Get that. Go we don't have any more water. You see, if we had to upgrade, I think our our watering can maybe might make it all the way through. Maybe not. You know, it's possible that it st that still wouldn't be enough. Oh, we just watered the same spot. It's possible that wouldn't be enough, but you know, you never really know. All right, almost done here. Then we can go over and uh, you know see what the chick's doing. See if it uh, became acquainted to its new surroundings. Um, it should have food in there still, so I'm not gonna really worry about that. Not gonna let it out, because what's the point, you know, as of right now? Sure, it makes them super happy, but, uh, I don't want to deal with that right now. Alright, let's do that. We're almost done here. Just two more. Boom. Done. Alright, let's go see your chicken. Let's go see, uh, Crumbo, Cumbo, whatever his name was that he randomized to. Alright, let's go that. I'll open it up. I'll let you out if you really want to go out. Alright, there you go. How you doing today? Cumbro looks fine. Alright, a couple more days and you should be fully grown. But let is go... Look at that, just zoomed out of there. Let's go up to the carpenter's area. And uh, start up before we do that. We should probably grab the wood. Because I don't want to walk over all the way over there and not have everything that we need. Uh, let's see, wood... Wood, 99 wood, should be enough. All right, we're here. Let us go and get this done. Um, do we? Need, what do we need to upgrade our house? Yeah, have a nice walk. Ah, uh, sure. Uh, construct farm buildings. Let's see. I want to do the big coop first, obviously. Like that's number one. Why can't I uh, build that? I don't have. I didn't bring my stone with me. Damn it. I didn't think I was going to need stone, so I was like, oh, I don't need to bring it. Stone. Why would you use stone in the upgrade? God dang it. Now I got to go all the way back. Go up here real quick. Grab this. We have more blackberries that have spawned up here. Oh, man. I didn't want to grab it. And I got to. Dang it. Dude, these blackberries are too much. They need to calm down. Oh, my God. There's a bunch out there, too. They need to calm down with the spawning of blackberries just too dang much and you know what we haven't done in a while that we need to do we need to go into the cave and harvest the mushrooms that are probably in there I keep forgetting that we have these 
Uh, grab, grab, grab. Those will be sold today for sure. For however much they make. I don't know, like, I want to do the coop because that's going to lead us to having more money. We can make more mayonnaise machines after that and be able to make more mayonnaise at the same time, which will be nice, you know, just a little bit extra, adding value to the eggs that we have. But, uh, you know, like, the kitchen would be pretty good, cool to have right now, I'd have to say. Alright, let's, let's see, uh, what about upgrading house? 450 pieces of wood. Uh, after my coop, we'll do that. Construct farm buildings, big coop. Build. Uh, select a coop to upgrade. There we go, I thought so. That coop right there, get upgraded. Okay, I'll start working it first thing tomorrow morning. You better. You better start working on that first thing tomorrow morning. We got things to do, alright? I have no idea where Abigail is at this time of day, but... I probably should give her, you know, at least something for this because, you know, we have, you know, courts, but we haven't given her any, or we have two gift options left, right? We still have two gift options for her. Yeah, we haven't even touched them. And I'm going to give her something on her birthday. I just haven't yet. I haven't got around to grabbing all the stuff. And we're going to, we have court, we have plenty of courts hidden about. Ooh, what's the, uh, the quest on today's bulletin board? Uh, for one tiger trout, I would like a tiger trout myself there too, Willie. And, uh, but, you know, unfortunately, we don't got enough for that. Mmm, so she's not home. Where else would she be? I don't know her schedule, like, at all. I always have to look it up. We might as well look it up, to be 100% honest. Let's, you can see my stuff. Hold on, you don't, you're only gonna see it for a little bit. There you go. Boom. Nope, you're gonna see it for longer, actually. Um, uh, where is the star? Do you, villagers? There we go. Hold on, Abigail. Where is she at? On fall, on Thursdays. She is standing at the bus stop at this current time. Okay. All right, we got it. She's at the bus stop. Let's go. That's pretty close to our house. At this exact time is when she's supposed to be there. It says that she walks home at 5. I don't know why she just, like, stands here. Or she's not here at all, you know? That's also happens. Nope, she's not here. You lie to me every time I read that. I swear. Like, every single time I read that, she's not there. Like, ever. Why is this game just a big liar? Like, all the time. You know what? We're just gonna go sell stuff. And I think we're just gonna leave it at that, and then we'll like first thing and first, you know, we'll run over there in the morning maybe, and go head over there and give her her stuff. All right, chandelier, sell that, 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 hazelnut, wild plum, fiber. All right. I mean, we could maybe, maybe actually, maybe she has like a special thing. For for windy days deviations. Let's see. For maybe for windy days, uh, she doesn't have a deviation for any time in the fall. Oh, the eleventh. Okay, when not good friends, she's at where? She's at Sebastian's room. Yo, what the? No, this is the ele nope. All right, we're bringing out the scythe, Sebastian. It's time to go. It's time to go. She's at Sebastian's room until we're good friends with her. What the heck? Nah, nah, time to go do a little chopping on the, you know, the old wood of Sebastian's. I'm ready, let's go. Says she leaves at 5, so I'm gonna be like right there just like standing out there like creeper or something. <laughs> They're like, hey, what are you doing in there? Nothing. I got you a quartz. Oh, thank you so much. Alright, let's see here. Let's see if this thing is true. This is a lie as well! Dude, this game just like constantly lies to me. Like every day. Every day I play this game and I read the freaking thing. It's a liar. I mean, I must have. Maybe there's another deviation that I didn't read. I guess it's kind of windy, you know? I mean, maybe there's a windy devi deviation? I have no idea. It says she starts walking home at like 10, or f I mean at 5. So. Maybe if I wait out here just like, you know, like maybe 40 minutes or so, she'll appear. Maybe. What's up? You know, 
Uh, isn't your name like Keenan Prono or something? You know, fuck you, Alex. Fuck you, man. Why you always gotta be in like you know smartass? Think you're so? Think you're like a football star? Thinking you're so cool, man. You don't. Dog doesn't even like you. That's that's just say a lot to your character. All right. Is this Penny? No. This, yeah, this is Penny. We're so very lucky to have a library in such a small town. When you're lost in a book, it's easy to forget the realities of your life. Uh, I know, maybe, maybe. I'm not really that kind of like a book person, but maybe that's a thing. I'm just gonna, you know, maybe we could play some pew. Oh, she's right there. Look at that. Well, good thing we came here. Hey, hey, how'd you know I was hungry? This looks delicious. Well, I'm glad it looks delicious. <laughs> Uh, you're playing like computer games with the TV off. I don't think that's very effective at all. Probably should turn the TV on if you want to win the video game. Probably. Seems like um, a pretty good idea, alright? Alright, well, I guess that's kind of it for everything we can do today, I'm pretty sure. The little, like, event isn't until, like, Tuesday, I think? Where we, we have to bring all, like, nine items and put it out there and have it be variety and things like that. Uh, I don't think we checked the TV weather report. It is going to be clear and sunny tomorrow. Oh. Living off the land, we're back again. What's our tip? Focus. Salmon. Salmon returns to their spawning grounds in the fall to lay eggs. This means the river is chock full of them. You can only find them in the fall, so get out there and cast your pole. Yeah, I, I found one, and I, you know, I gave it to Sebastian. I'll probably catch another one, because we have to sell it still. That's a lot of foraging. That was a lot of foraging that we got there. Alright, are we good? Are we good? Alright, I'll see you guys next time with many more Stardew Valley to come. I'm Sergio Kenai.